my sweet, sweet Doc Martin friends, and welcome back to today's YouTube Doc Martin review. So today we're going to get into the women's Olsen sandal. I was actually going to do the other gladiator sandal, the one with the laces, because they definitely seem to be trending. However, personally, I'm not here to be on the trend. I'm just here to review what I think is cool and maybe help you guys out on the way. So we are going to start talking about the material today. We're just going to get right into it. So these are considered a lightweight milled Napa leather with the Gladiator upper. This leather is soft and durable and hard wearing as described by Doc Martin. Little to no break in process. The style of these is a front zipper with adjustable buckles that makes them easy to take on and off. The yellow stitching is a classic piece, of course, and how we have come to know and love Doc Martin. This pair has sealed welted lines as well at 700 degrees Celsius and has the welt stitch. These are perfect, as I have mentioned, for those of you who are looking for immediate comfort in a stylish sandal, as most Doc Martens are. And I've gotten about, I want to say 40, at least 40 hours of wear in these guys. I definitely have worn these to shows, that's why they're a little beat up. So... I want to get into a little bit about the padding and the soles. This appears to be a cross between the Beck sole and the Classic sole, both of which provide quality comfort. There's not as much height on these. However, this particular shoe is a bit heavier. This particular shoe weighs in at about two pounds for both of them. And the sizing of these is best if sized down due to the slight platform sole. Now that is just me speaking in terms of those of you who may have a more average size foot. Again, I always say go ahead and try them on if you are able to. There's little to no slipping on these as well, as you will see. I love actually taking Doc Martens, especially the Jaden Boots hiking. So this is why I wanted to get this footage to show you how really durable and lightweight and just amazingly grippy these are. Supreme, laterally, there's barely any slippage. And I think for a shoe like this, that is super fun because you can pretty much go anywhere in them. And I love the sleekness of these two. For a gladiator sandal, they are chunky. They definitely make a statement, but they also have a sleekness to them, which I think, or I attempted to represent here. So overall, come in at around the $100 and $140-ish price range. If you're interested in these, they are currently on sale in white. However, I was not really able to find them in the black, unfortunately. But you can find them on other websites in the black. I will link them down below. So let's get into the cons of these. So obviously the zipper is a little rough on here. I am showing you this because I was like, oh my God, I have to redo that because it was so bad. But that zipper is a little tough. But as you can see here to the back of the Gladiator sandals slide over, I have another pair of sandals in one of my reviews. I showed you guys that it did that. So that is kind of a common problem for Doc Martin. It's a little annoying, but definitely nothing that's not tolerable. And then the final con is kind of the way I walk in them, maybe. I don't know. Maybe your feet are different. I just felt like mine looked really weird. So, anywho, what I'm saying and what the consumer is saying, I did take some of these clips from Doc Martin so you could just get an easy look at the reviews really fast. And overall, I definitely would probably give these an 8.5 out of 10 on my own scale. They're not ones I reach for that much, but I do love the edginess they give and the statement they make. They're also extremely comfortable. I was climbing up that wall. You've seen me. I had no issues. So, you know, overall, I think an 8.5 out of 10 is a good rating. So if you like this, guys, please comment down below. Subscribe. If you have any reviews you want me to do, please let me know. I'm hoping to improve upon the overall aesthetic of this channel that's really my goal and obviously to provide you with as much information as I can to inform you of Doc Martens and how versatile and amazing they are so thank you so much for being here guys I appreciate it as always and can't wait to see you in the next one